At 11.56 on 25th April 2015, Nepal was shaken by its worst earthquake since 1934. Homes were destroyed, schools crumbled, and almost 9,000 people were killed. The cost of the damage and subsequent aftershocks was estimated to be in the billions of pounds. For us as a charity, the impact was equally catastrophic. 13 of our Gorkha veterans or widows living in the region were killed. Over 2,000 of their houses were damaged or destroyed and over 75 of our water projects and 160 of our schools were also damaged. We're walking through the rubbles seeing, hoping to see some of our antennas. We mobilized immediately and worked to get aid to those in need. In the first few months, we distributed over 1,408 packs, 1,100 metal shelters, and gave solar lights and cash grants to veterans and widows affected. Our longer term response focuses on three key strands. Building earthquake resistant homes for our Gurkha pensioners, repairing and rebuilding schools, and repairing and constructing new water projects. The Queen's Gurkha engineers have also been supporting our emergency and rebuilding efforts as part of Operation Mahmud, which means rebuild in Nepali. This is absolutely an you know, honor to be here because uh, we've been to all over the country, you know, and just to come in Nepal, your home country, and to do something, you know, for your home is, is absolutely amazing. Nepal is our home. We've been here for a long time and will be here for many years to come. We estimate that it will cost us nearly 18 million pounds to complete our earthquake response work. By doing so, we will make sure that Gurkha veterans, their widows and their communities are able to live their lives with dignity once more. <laughs>